Well, children are taking on City Hall. They are fighting an issue they say is impacting their health. Pesticides in parks. They don't want it spread. News 4's Roseanne Coletti reports on the testimony and the lesson that prompted it. This land is my land. Not the sort of testimony usually heard in the New York City Council chambers. Hey, hey. The young witnesses from PS290 pushing for a measure to limit pesticide use in city parks. And what does a kindergartner know about pesticides? And there's something poison that kills the bugs. This third grader digs even deeper. It's like the spray that goes on the ground to like kill the weeds, and um, it's really bad for your body. The youngsters actually provided the inspiration for the bill. They had been studying environmental issues in school and expressed their concerns about parks and playgrounds on a visit to City Hall. That produced bill number 0800, common sense, according to its sponsor. This is aimed at synthetic pesticides. Uh, they're these great natural pesticides that you can use, and uh, they do just the same thing without being as harmful to people. But unnecessary, says the Parks Department. It testified New York City already has a very tough pesticide law, regulating what may and may not be used. No, we don't use any, play, any pesticides in playgrounds, directly around playgrounds, picnic areas, places where we know people are going to congregate. They're going to roll on the ground. They're going to do what kids do in public spaces. The measure has not been an overnight success. It has taken more than two years to reach the hearing stage. But if it does pass, little voices certainly helped it along. This land was made for you and me. Roseanne Coletti, News 4, New York.